what's up everyone we are again on the road but you don't know we have to get the content out so Kish, you know we've been speaking a lot about um Kishane thompson and 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 you know we've been because he's the talk of the town and everything and you know he's doing well and all of that right but some it, it seems as if we tend to forget about oblique civil because what I want you guys to know is that you should not be surprised if oblique civil take that 100 meter goal it is quite possible that he can do so and one of the reasons why I believe that is because normally the pressure would be on oblique civil because at that time like last year and the year before it was like our only hope and now this year we've seen many athletes come out proving that you know um they are here and they're here to stay you know um athlete like kishin we now realize that most of the pressure is on kishin right now and oblique is being ignored to some extent and that is actually good for oblique because he can now focus he can now have less pressure going in and 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 be able to be as calm as possible mentally right not that i'm saying that kishane won't be calm but going in with less pressure can definitely work in oblique civils um benefit so we 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 can expect to see something great from oblique civil also which i don't mind you know we get in the one two or the the um the 100 and 200 no not 100 until the gold and the silver for the 100 meter so I don't mind us getting first and second. I do believe that is what is going to happen. I believe Jamaica is going to get gold and silver for that 100 meter. Um, so yeah, but pay close attention to Oblique Seville because he's looking really good in his um, training videos over there in Paris. He looks very relaxed. He looks happy, he looks calm, he's enjoying himself. And so, you know, because he, he's been there before. And so I do believe that he's going to do something special in that 100 meter. So I won't be surprised if he upsets the field and upsets the favorite. However, I do still have Kishin running and breaking that olympic record but i won't be surprised if i'm proven wrong by oblique civil so i think it will be an interesting one to watch um i think it will be an interesting event to watch it's going to be special and we should just look forward for great things to happen with these two athletes you know what I mean? Um, the media houses are talking from other countries, but we know what we know here. And we know that our athletes are going to deliver something special. Now, as it relates to Sherika Jackson, you know, the news has been reported that she will withdraw from the 100 meters to focus on the 200 meter now here's my theory behind all of that i believe that her being injured after the national championships um it 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 it, it, it has a part to play in this one because she 
would be pressuring her body to run the one and the two doing the double and so she has chosen to do the 200 meter um, I do believe that she don't want to pressure herself because of the injury that she had after the Jamaica National Trials so that's, that's one of my theory one of my other theory is that she's probably planning to go very very fast in that 200 meter and so she wants to focus solely on it so she can give it her all and go after the record so that's my other theory as to why I believe she is withdrawing from the 100 meter my third theory is that she is probably right now not a hundred percent fit and sees the and the coaching staff and everyone sees the 200 meter as the safer option with less pressure throughout the rounds and decide that all right this is the one that we are going to go with so that those are my three um theories behind um, the fact that she is pulling out of the 100 meters. So those are my assumptions. I may be wrong, but that is what I think. All right. So big up to everyone. Stay tuned for another video later this evening. Remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe.